You guys suck at this hero, so I'm gonna pick someone else. Alrighty. Sewer rat or glyph guardian? Ew. Okay. Prime Gaming group up. Blizzard and Prime Gaming are teaming up to deliver some legendary goodies for you all. Climb the ranks. Unlock fantastical items and more for play Overwatch, play Hearthstone, Warcraft, and Starcraft. Read more. So Alkali Lake writes, Prime members can claim monthly Hearthstone offers for a total of four random legendary cards, three standard card packs. Today until April 27th. Members can claim the first Prime Gaming Hearthstone drop, which includes a random legendary card to celebrate a voyage uh, to the sunken city. Time's up. Off you go. Welcome back, Ace. <laughs> up because here we go I may take two. Oh, nice we got the tie Onward and upward. ow fuck quit I'm gonna give you guys some behind the scenes action for lobby legends happening this weekend i reached out to our americas and european players to ask them questions just so i'm prepared to talk about them on stream just to learn about them uh gia reached out to china chinese and apac players so we reached out to all of them um Marvelous. <laughs> i asked them what their greatest accomplishments were I will spoil one of them. I will spoil Educate Colin's greatest accomplishment. He cleaned his room recently. <laughs> this wasn't a, oh, what I was expecting. I thought he would say something like, One Global Invitationers. Or something. <laughs> nope. I cleaned my room recently. Good job, Callens. Excellent work. Very proud. So that's a little sneak peek at what we'll be looking at. Puppy cam or uh, it says it's on. Don't you worry. You'll be soaring the sky in no time. Can't wait for Silas to lobby the legends. Yeah, I'm pretty pumped. Howard will be uh, casting it on his channel, so that's exciting. I wonder if I can cast it to my channel while I'm doing it. How it's done. Great job. I should have bought that first, that was a misplay. Is that where you got, wait. Do you have one more year or did you match? Did you have your match day and you didn't tell us about it? You matched. Okay, tell us about match day. What did you get? University of... He did? Was I not paying attention? <laughs> I'm sorry, I missed it. I feel bad when I miss things. Okay. What did you match in? It was a, is it University of Michigan that's there? Yeah, I think it's University of Michigan. What did you match with? 
Radiology. Oh, that's such a good one. That's what my friend is. Quite what we wanted. Safety restrictions offline. Chris, okay. My friend is a radiologist and she loves it. She loves it so much. She's She's done with her residency and everything now, has a full-time job doing it. And she can do it from home sometimes. She like has to go into office sometimes and then some days she gets to stay and work from home. Reality's so nice. Don't have to interact with too many humans. <laughs> I forgot to turn the game sound on. Ah! That is loud. Okay. So we're gonna level. Sell. Okay. Sure. You ugly crying over the envelope. Oh! I mean, dude, it's an accomplishment, especially if it was one of your top picks. Like, my friend who's a radiologist, she didn't match. She really wanted ortho. Didn't match, even though she's top in her class. But the next day... So she cried, she ugly cried, but for other reasons. But the next day, she got a call from Stanford saying, we want you for radiology, even though that's not what you wanted to do. And now she's a radiologist and she loves it. So she's very happy that she ended up in radiology and not in ortho. <laughs> Was your number one choice and it's a top 10 program? Nice. I bet your family's super stoked. Though I bet they're also not stoked to live in the cold considering you guys are Arizona people. <laughs> new adventure, new clothes. I guess it's kind of cold where you are now, right? Not the same type of cold though. She's Louise. I guess this is something. One, two, three. All right, we'll look for Agam. So it was awesome that first day, and after that, <laughs> Neep. I think snow is great for visiting. Snow is great for vacation. I will vacation to snow. I will not live in snow. I went from Arizona to Michigan. I agree that after the first couple of years, I was ready for the desert heat again. <laughs> yeah, grew up in Arizona. I went to college in Colorado for like a year and a half and I just couldn't do it. I'm like, no. I don't know why people choose to live this way. Went back to Arizona. 
And now I'm in Florida, so. And Critter's from Ohio. So he, born and raised with snow, moved to Arizona for school, experienced what it's like to not live in snow, and now he doesn't want to go back. He's like, I experienced what it's like to be without snow, and I love it. Let's never go back again. And I'm like, yes, let's, let's, I agree. I agree. Oh, it's a six year program. Damn. You're a Coloradoan. If the infrastructure is there for snow, it's not bad at all. Mm. I was in Colorado. I didn't like it. So it's really the shitty parts the in-between season? Like fall and spring? What? I thought people love autumn. I think you're high. I think you're high. I love autumn, I hate fall. They're the same thing. What? I'm confused. Do we won? We won! We didn't get it. Agam doesn't exist. Summertime and the living's easy. I normally hate summer in Florida, but this summer I'll have a pool and a baby. So maybe I'll like it this time. Or maybe I'll hate it. Who knows? <laughs> They're working on the landscaping again today. Also, fun fact, I'm wearing a swimsuit. Tell your significant others, or if you are a girl, keep this in mind. Swimsuit is the best pregnancy hack that I've come up with so far. It is my favorite pregnancy hack so far is to wear a swimsuit instead of a bra. <laughs> Bras don't fit me anymore. I don't want to buy new ones. Swimsuit works. So now I just wear swimsuits. <laughs> She put swimsuit stream in the title. <laughs> swimsuit live. Why is it here? Well, there's a box truck down in the front. He took a little off, but... Can I tell him? 
<laughs> My stomach's huge. Hi, gum. Travels, minion. Can't stop a good week. So here's your goal. Okay. Keepers! Why didn't we kill the Baron when we had a chance? Hello, people. The Baron. Am I pregnant? Did you just see my belly? Do you have to ask? <laughs> hey, hey, hey! This is horse shit. Gone triple. Safe travels, minion. You're so no, I'm just messing with you, man. You're fine. I like to mess with people. Ew. Just like amalgadons like to mess with me. My goodness. Everyone's gunning for you. Sorry. Need to text my pool guy. The fire pits here so that they can build the fire pit. I had to buy a fire pit. But they're building like around it to make it part of the pool area, like tile and stuff. Oh. And that's how it's 
Winning, son. I'm doing pretty well. Yeah. Awesome. I did. Okay. Thank you. Top two, top two. Victory. Welcome aboard, Minion. My shield for honor. I like that one. It's so trash. <laughs> Luna, thank you. There you go. There you go. Right, I think we won. Six, twelve, eighteen, twenty four, twenty six. Enough. Ah. Maths all day. I don't think I changed anything. I just think it is what it is right now. Did the Koba generate all these stats? Mostly. Yeah. Some jugs, some light things. Mostly gems. Like this one, I transferred Agam gems as well. Hey, what are we doing with this Baron over here, buddies? The Baron? The Baron? The Baron? 
Oh my god. Lee! Why are we attacking your Baron? There it is. I got it. got some decent points for this game. There were some high MMR people in this lobby. Let's see how many we got. 98! Oh! What does that mean? Size matters, so people can check out what size they are by typing the command size. See if they're chonkers or dinkers or average or growers or showers. 